Hey everyone, good day to all. Myself, Dr. AJ Maudia. Today in this video, I'm going to talk about the seizures. From this board, guys, you are going to get one MCQ is pakka. Mark my word, one MCQ is pakka. Okay, so guys, before watching, before watching this video, please try to watch my my video. I did a role play of this all types of the seizures, not all types, so mainly one. Okay, so please try to watch that video. After that only, you have to you have to study about the seizures. Okay, so guys, first let us discuss what is seizure. Seizure is due to abnormal electrical discharge. Or as called as, it is a paroxysmal or sudden synchronized hyperactivity. Okay, see, it is an abnormal electrical discharge, guys. Everything is burst out. All the functions are getting higher and higher. Okay, the seizure. Okay, so what is seizure and epilepsy? Seizure, when it occurs, one or two times. Okay. Epilepsy means it, when it occurs more than two and three, more than four times. It is called epilepsy. Seizure, abnormal electrical, abnormal electrical discharges. See, there are many types of seizures. The first one is the subtail seizure. Subtail seizure. This is most common in the most common in neonates. Common in neonates less than twenty eight days old childs. Due to incomplete myelination or hypoxemia or hypoxic ischemia encephalopathy. They will just ask which of the following is the most common seizure in neonate. It is a subtle seizure. Seizure. Drug of choice is phenobarbitone. C. Barbitone. Neon. Neonate. One. Tone. One. C. Neon. Neonate. One. It means one month. Barbitone, C. The drug of choice will be phenobarbitone, always it is the IV. Next, coming to the febrile seizure. Febrile seizure, I think you know this is febrile seizure due to high fever. The most common age is 6, six months to 5 years or 6 months to 6 years. Okay, it is due to increase in temperature, body temperature that is fever. It is also, it looks like the GTCS. But here, the neurological symptoms are, symptoms are normal. Okay. In febrile seizures, we are having two types. Simple and complex. Simple and complex. You can see the video description. I already, I, I already differentiate between the simple and complex. Okay. So, what's the drug of choice? It is the rectal diagepum or loragepum. Always IV. The prophylaxis for the febrile seizure it is Cloba G Pam. It is a Cloba G Pam. Okay. So the coming to the next one, it is the infantile spasm or salam seizure. Or it is called as West syndrome. It is mostly seen in the one to two years. One to two years of age. It is a combination of epileptic spasm. And a developmental delay. This combination of epileptic spasm and a developmental delay. See here, all the muscles goes into contraction spasm, having the flexion and extensor. See, always child says like this: head, this, this is hand, this always goes toward like a salam, salam alaikum, salam alaikum toward the head. This head, this. Hand will always go toward the forehead like this one. Salam alaikum, salam alaikum. Always do like this. Salam alaikum. That's why it is called the salam seizure. In India, both flexor and extensor is the most common in India. You have to remember one thing is that in the ECG, it shows it is a hips arrhythmia. It is a hips arrhythmia. It is a disorganized EEG. What is the drug of choice? It is the ACTH. It is the ACTH and steroids, but ACTH is the most one, most important one. So infantile spasm or salam seizure, they will give the history of like this one. There is a major contraction or they will see you having the flexion, flexion and extension. You have to remember this one, easy source hypsarrhythmia. Okay, 
Done, done, done. So, now coming to the juvenile myoclonic epilepsy. Juvenile myoclonic epilepsy. It occurs in the age of 10 to 19 years old. Juvenile myoclonic epilepsy occurs in the age of 10 to 19 years of old. It is also called as Jan syndrome. Also called as Jan syndrome. For the juvenile myoclonic epilepsy, they will give the history of early morning seizure. Early morning seizure. Wherever, whenever the child will, will wake up, he will get the sudden bilateral myoclonic jugs. Sudden bilateral myoclonic jugs. Okay. In the, in the question, they will give the history of early morning. It is there. Mark the answer as juvenile clonics, epilepsy or Jan syndrome. Jan syndrome. EEG, you have to remember this one. It is a 4 to 6 hedge, polywave and a spike pattern. Okay. So, what is the drug of choice? It is the valproate. It is the valproate. What is the drug of choice for juvenile myoclonic seizure? It is a valproate. Or else, if, the, if, the, if there is no option in the... There is no valproate in the option. You can go for the lamotrigine. The next one is the absence or... Petit mal seizure. Petit mal seizure. See, petit mal. Small children's. See, absence are petit mal seizure. Is small children's. Absence. These are seen in school going children's. School going children's. You can see my video. I also did the role play of this one. What happens here is that there is no loss of conscience or no feeling of them. No feelings. What happens here that the child always blinks his eyes. Blinks his eyes open and close. Open and closing of the eyes. The, 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 the children will be blank staring, having the blank staring episodes. Few seconds. The, the patient, the children always is open and close his eyes. Open, close, open and close his eyes. And the child is unresponsive. Unresponsive. Unresponsive for the 3 to 4 seconds. 5 to 6 seconds. 5 to 6 seconds. Hence, hence the children having the poor performance. Poor performance. And the teachers always having, giving complaint to their, to their parents. About that, your son is not studying. He always, uh, uh, he, he always doing like this. Blah, 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 blah. Okay. So, you have to remember is the sir. Okay, now. Nah? The child will having the blank staring absurds. Everything is blank. He will just do this one like closing of eyes, opening, closing of eyes, that, that's it. He will unresponsiveness. Okay now. So for this one, for the petit mal are the option seizures. You have to give the if the child age is less than six years, less than five years, sorry. Less than five years, it is the etuk C mide. C mide. If the child having age of more than 5 years, sorry, child age is less than 5 years, you have to give the ethoxyamide. The child age is more than 5 years, you have to give the valproate. Got it? Got it. Okay. Then, last one coming to the GTCS. That is, generalized tonic-clonic seizure. You can also watch my video this one. You will come to know everything. It is also called as grand mal epilepsy. Grand mal epilepsy means old boys. It means the most common age is 16 to 18 years and above. In this, we are having the three phases. First, second, third. First is the loss of conscience. Patient will fall down. See my video once. Patient will fall down. After, 20 to 30, after 10 to 20 seconds, all the muscle con goes contraction. All the muscles will contract it. Third stage is the clonic stage. See, you are having the, in the second stage only we have the teeth, clench, tongue bite, extra salivation, everything is there. Third stage is the, the clonic stage. All muscles are contracted and having the altered seizure. The patient may have the confusion. The patient may, may vomit it, nausea, everything. If the GTCS is lost more than five months, Five minute. If the GTCS lasts for more than five five minute, five minute, then it is called as 
status epilepticus called as status epilepticus you have to see the question you have to always see the timing of the you see the timing of the gtcs if it is more than 5 minutes then do not mark the answer as the wall private okay na for the status epilepticus the the drug of choice will be, will be the iv lorazepam iv lorazepam for the gts you have to see the timings if it is less than 5 minutes it means it is a gtcs then the drug of choice will be the wall private drug of choice will be the wall private since wall private is a, is a very teratogenic for the pregnant females for the female guys for the pregnant female if you want to become the uh, if you want to become the pregnant if you are using the wall private please please stop the wall private please stop the wall private then use the levi tiracetam levi tiracetam or lamotrigine or lamotrigine for the female who want to become the pregnant first of all you have to stop using wall private then use levi tiracetam or lamotrigine for females who are having gtcs only for the females who are already pregnant who are already pregnant please don't stop the wall private continue the wall private continue the wall private and add folic acid that is 400 mg per day or 400 mcg per day i think it is crystal clear i think it's crystal and clear guys so thank you thank you very much if you have any more doubts please try to test me ask me anytime thank you